I have my pen and I'm gonna put my pig in so I can study his features. Welcome back to another Build Versus. This time, I'm joined with Scott as we try to build along the theme of pig house versus cow house. I've been doing a lot of videos recently with the theme of pigs, so why not continue it with today's Build Versus? Hopefully, it doesn't turn out too strange because I really struggle at recreating mobs. If you don't know the rules of Build Versus, we have 30 minutes to create a build that goes along with a given theme. This house must include a bedroom, a bathroom, a living room, and a kitchen. And of course, we can't forget our trusty mailbox. Also, make sure to leave a like on the video. Otherwise, tonight, you'll wake up to this piggy in your bed. Let's get on to the build. Three, two, one, get building. Oh God, I forgot how stressful this is. It's like build battle and I haven't done that in forever. It is really stressful. I'm gonna spawn in a pig. In a There's already pen. a pig on my land and I feel like you've sent him over to sabotage <laughs> me. I have my pen and I'm gonna put my pig in so I can study his features. Have a look, you've got to find the perfect pig skin color. Concrete mm. seems to do the job. Yeah, I'm trying to just figure out like how white mine is gonna be. Just grabbing all of the colors for the pig. I got the black for the eyes and I need the white for the eyes. And I am ready to go. I think I'm just gonna do his head. Oh yeah, same, I'm not doing anything other than that. No. No, I don't think I'd be able to do the entire body. I don't know if this is centered. I guess it doesn't matter. It's just a pig. This is where it matters. And his face goes all I'm wonky. Maybe I should have done that. I don't know. I'm worried now. One, two, three, four. No! Okay, he's centered. It's all good. Yay! Yay, look at that. It's a, it's a pink line. It's a wall, a pig wall. I've got the snout of my cow. You've already got the snout? Oh my gosh, that's the part I need to do. Yeah, I'm gonna give him some eyes. Okay, let's have a look at your face. Oh, you are do so I, beautiful. Do I do it like Minecraft or do I make him less derpy? I think you make the pig however you want the pig. Well, mine's a cow, so I'm hoping oh. I'm not making him <laughs> pig. Yeah, I'd have some competition then. <laughs> you turned around and I have also made a pig house. <laughs> yeah. It's just pig house versus pig house. Pig house that's better than mine as well, so I'm pure raging. I've gone for a slightly cuter version than what the actual Minecraft one is. I think I might too, because they really don't make the mobs look cute, do they? No, they make them kind of derpy and like, I want them to be cute. I don't know how to make it cute though, is the problem. It's a pig in Minecraft. I'm not sure how cute they can get. He does look derpy. What the heck? I mean, I don't hate it, but I'm also just not feeling it. I don't know what it is, but I'm just gonna carry on building the house it's, now. It's fine. If you persevere, I'm sure it'll work out. There is literally no point stressing out about the front of it too much because I never give myself enough time to decorate the inside, so that should be a priority. Yeah. <laughs> I always remember that from when I've done the last ones that it's like, oh yeah, we need to decorate the inside too. I always, always spend way too too much time doing the outside of the build and it's just pointless in the end. Did we used to get 15 minutes to this or has it always been half an hour? It was 20 minutes but it was just too stressful. That I feel like the it. extra 10 minutes just makes it so much easier. Wish I'd had that extra 10 minutes when I did my Grinch house. <laughs> <laughs> that was a great Flashbacks build. Flashbacks to not finishing the Santa hat and being mad about I it. I know, yeah. <laughs> that was such a good time though. I really liked your Grinch. Apart from, you know, it was missing a bit but it still turned out like a really good build. I think the sad thing was the fact that I thought I was done and I hadn't realised that I just hadn't flown to the backside and just not seen part of the hat, <laughs> just not fell in. I will not be, be doing sad. that with this cow. I will be making sure everything is done. And I'm just going to make sure I get the inside done, really. That's my priority, I think. Here we go, just filling in the good old roof. Pretty it's easy It's funny because it's when I think of a cow, I think of black and white, but obviously Minecraft cows are brown. Yeah, I don't know why that is. Maybe there's a particular type of cow in Sweden where Minecraft was made. That's very true, it could be that. Piggy, you look pretty good. Um, kind of worried about where the door's gonna go. That looks weird. <laughs> this looks really weird. Oh no. Oh, are you doing the door in the snout? Yeah. Oh, I don't know what to do with mine. It's fine. Hmm. Need to pick out a nice floor. I'm gonna go with this Valentine's block. Look at that, beautiful. Pink, gorgeous. Let's replace this floor in here. Nice pink floor for some little pigs. Oh, we don't have carpenter's doors anymore. There is a different kind of door, I believe. It's not carpenter's, but it's called something else. Is but it, it is similar. Doors? Yeah, I think it's that. I guess we'll find out. It is similar. It's not the same, but I think you can do the same things with it, I guess. Or I think it colors it in just the one color. Ah, okay. So like an invisible door kind of situation. Oh no, wait, I can do what I was planning on doing. It lets me do like a different block on the top and a different block on the bottom. Oh, yeah, that's good. 
I need to try figure out my door situation here because it goes into his snout, so it looks really weird. Okay, I'm now onto the interior. Now, my only issue here is that the house is quite small. Oh, his nose looks really funny. I'm gonna have to get rid of my doors there, I think. I'm gonna have to have my door to the side or something. I just can't, can't let this be. Maybe from the side could be nice. Yeah, I'm gonna do a side door. I feel like I have no option but to do a side door. I mean, that's fair. <laughs> it's just the way that it's happened. Like, if I was to do what I wanted to do, which was have the door in the snout, it looks really weird. It looks very strange. Now, remind me again, what are the requirements for this to pass as a house? We need a bathroom, a bedroom, a living room, and a kitchen. Bathroom, bedroom, living room, kitchen. Okay. All right, I got a side entrance here. Very nice. Lead you down there with some path. We have 22 minutes remaining, so I'm, I feel like I'm making good time. Yeah, I'm per I'm now onto the inside, so it's just actually making it work. All right, I have a doorway. I could do with getting some flowers down, some pink ones, you know, like a pig. A lilac too, just because I really like them. Right, we're going again for the fancy route that I normally do. I just did your trick and it worked. Amazing. Yep. <laughs> All right, I think this is looking pretty good. Okay, that's cute. All right, moving on to the inside. Oh gosh, the ceiling is really low in here. I am worried. Maybe I could make this work though. I'm determined to attempt, and attempt is the strong word here, have an enclosed bathroom rather than when we normally do it and it's just like, here's your bedroom with your toilet in the corner. <laughs> Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to do that too. I'm gonna make a little balcony for my bedroom on the upstairs, I think. Yeah. And then I can do the bathroom straight underneath it. I think that's the only way I can do it because the build is so small on the inside. Yeah, minus two. And I want to, as I said, not have that, but if I need to, I need to. This might look cute though when I finish with it. Just depends if it turns out how I'm thinking, which it usually doesn't. I was gonna say, they never do. They never turn out how we hope. All right, I have a bathroom sign as well. You know what? Put that there. So you know it's a toilet. I'm now on to decorating the bathroom, which is pretty okay. good. I feel like I'm making progress today. I never usually feel this confident. Oh, it's a really hard choice. Where do I put the toilet? Hmm. I know I'm the exact same. It's gonna have to go there next to the bath. Is that weird? Toilet next to the bath? No, I'm trying to leave the bath's not that weird. It's very cramped in here, like literally three oh. blocks wide. <laughs> Mine is basically a fancy like hallway with a door on it. So what? you'll see. Mine is literally a three blocks wide bathroom, but it's fine. I don't know if I'm gonna have a, I think I'm just gonna have to go for a shower. I don't know if I'm gonna have space for a tub. Oh wow, yours must be small then if you haven't got space. I That's thought mine was small. Oh no, no, mine is small. Mm, what can I put on the wall? What I reminds you of a bathroom? I stuck in the bathroom. Fish? You stuck in the bathroom? I got stuck in the shower. So <laughs> I hate this shower design, I hate it. Maybe I will just go for a- This hasn't turned out that bad. I kind of think it's cute. I'm gonna put down a little pink carpet too, if it can fit. It's just so pink in this house. I don't hate it. Fit in your color scheme? I love it. I'm gonna have a little window there and one up here too. Two. I'm gonna go for the glass. My pig doesn't have ears. Does that matter? I think I no, should add them fine. in. I saw your cow has ears. Yeah. My cat has ears and little horns. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I might need to do that. Mine is definitely like a single person's apartment. Like it's not, you can't have more than one person living here. Honestly, I think mine might be the same because I'm gonna just have to put a single bed. This bedroom's gonna be too small. Yeah, I had to just go a single bed because when bed. I tried a double bed and it just wasn't having it. I've got my single bed. Maybe I could add a plant here. So that's a priority, isn't it? Always. Get the plants in. I've done my bedroom and I need to work in my, I've got my bedroom and my bathroom. And I need to work in my kitchen, dining, living room studio <laughs> everything in one this is like a studio apartment on the bottom floor my bedroom is so tiny it's cute though so i mean it's fine but it is just literally so small everything is so small in this house all right put a paint in that can i not hello i'm not allowed to put a paint in there that has upset me pink carpet can go down very nice all right that's the bedroom that is the tiniest bedroom i've ever made in minecraft and to get the modern stairs on the go see i went for a spiral staircase see how this looks oh a spiral staircase yep went for us spiral staircase i don't even know how you have room to do that i wish i did all right what's this looking like I think that's cute. I could put a PC down here. We have 16 minutes left and I feel like I've made oh. really, really good progress. Oh, I thought we were gonna have like six minutes left. So <laughs> I was like, oh God, run. Get a little chair in here. I've got a computer down and everything. This is so good. I've gone for a slightly different color scheme downstairs than I usually would. Oh really? I thought everything was gonna be brown. I don't know why. 
Maybe it's because no, the cat on the is. Inside, yeah, on the outside it's brown, so I wanted to contract that with some colour on the inside. I could actually probably have a computer as well. I need, what is this? Purple kitchen. Yes, let's go for it. Everything's pink inside. Not hating it though. I think it looks cute. See, I went a very different route. I am excited to see what you've done with the place. Get the fruit out. The last time I did this, I was stressing so much that I put an extractor fan above the sink. Love that. <laughs> it was not good. So I'm not gonna make that mistake today. Here is my oven. You can go there actually. Cute. I need cupboards, but I don't even know how you get them up in this. Would it be kitchen? Okay, it's kind of cute though. Oh my gosh, I'm living for this. Oh. I'm kind of wishing I'd done mine a little bit further back, but it's fine. I do not have space here for a living room really. It's gonna be very cramped. Here we go, get the kitchen floor down. Kitchen's very small too. <laughs> It's cute though. Yeah, a lot of mine is very, very small, hmm. but we're making it work. Oh, a cookie jar. Yeah, it's got to get that. Just has to happen. That is so cute. Hmm. I'm confused now. I don't know what to add. I guess I need a sofa next. A sofa can be like that. Hmm, no. Maybe like this. TV there. Oh no, because it's so small, I don't know where to put everything. Yeah, I kind of had that issue. This is not very good. Oh, I don't know what kind of TV to go for. Yeah, I didn't bother with the TV in mine. I think I'm gonna have to go for a smaller sofa. Put that there. Oh, this is looking really, really cute right now. There are also some adorable carpets. So I'm gonna try some of them out. Just have to find one that's small enough because this place is tiny. Hmm. I think I'm just gonna make my own carpet. I'm just using the color. You know what? I don't hate it. Let's get a lamp in here. Oh my gosh, a back garden, really? Oh, I have some catching up to do then, I guess. I'm trying to get the perfect painting right now. I don't know what I want. It just has to look good. Does, does that look good? You know what? It's fine. I'm trying to make a really cute little feature of these plants, but the lack of windows in here is quite sad. Yeah, I may do with what I could for windows. Obviously limited by what we had. i get some movie posters up. Have a look. What is this one? You know what? We'll take it. That's cute. There we go. We are a big fan of movies here. I'm just like trying to make everything look semi like it's meant to exist there rather than it looking like I've just threw random stuff down like yes this is okay. Mine doesn't look like that it just doesn't look big enough. <laughs> <laughs> like seriously, it's really small inside. You could do a tour of my house in five seconds. <laughs> Everything is there. Got my bathroom, bedroom, living room, kitchen. Done. I'm not sure why people would choose to live in this house, but yeah. if they did. That's kind of what I'm thinking. It is way too small for anything. It's like we're just building an apartment for like someone in London. Basically, it is so small in here. I'm gonna decorate it with some pigs. Where did that go? I put a pig down, it disappeared. I'm worried. <laughs> the pig has disappeared. Literally. I put one down, don't know where it's gone. Oh well, guess it's not my problem anymore. Okay, but Wait. the pig just was like, no thank you, I'm not being part of this. What am I stuck on? The posters stop you walking up the stairs, that's actually so upsetting. Oh no! Why are you like this? I'm glad I noticed that though. Yeah, rather than trying to give me the tour and then none of us being able to get past. I'd have definitely lost. <laughs> All right, how's this? Where can this pig go? I have to put him somewhere. Maybe if I made a quartz shelf, he could go in there somewhere. This is looking cute. It's just too small, whatever. It's gonna be fine. I'm gonna go ahead and add the mailbox. Can't forget that, go there. And you know what? I'm gonna add some recycling bins because we are friendly to the environment. But let's wow. go ahead with the bin. I think I'm gonna let my pig go too. Be free, oh. friend. You could go and live your life. I really wanna grow up tree do you have a tree no. oh you have a bush though and you have what is that a swing what the heck okay nice. i need to catch up with this i'm gonna grow a tree here oh i hate it this isn't the tree that i wanted it's not what i planned not at all all right it's still cute though it still works i think i'm very close to finishing here oh you know what i think i am i just put down the last flower i think it just looks perfect yeah i'm not even i don't i'm gonna do a little bit of bone meal and then i'm ready how much time do we still have? We have five minutes. Oh damn. I mean, I don't want to add too much more. I think I'm happy with mine too. Oh my goodness, are we about to like finish early? I think we has are. Has ever been done before? I don't think so, but I'm really happy with this. I don't think I could add anything else because the build is so small on the inside. I've even done a garden kind of, so pretty much ready. Oh. Okay, well if we've finished, then let's take a tour of yours. Okay, so this is my cow build. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. I love it. So he's there, you've got a little window with some flower boxes and such, but I'll show you in the inside, we'll work our way through. So it's you'd like to so come inside. cute. 
Yeah. We have our yellow kitchen and dining slash living area over here. Oh, I see what you were saying now with yeah. the fact that you went for a different colour and everything. You went for yeah. yellow. Touch around the back here, we have a little home office. Ooh. Separated by the TV unit, just gives a little bit of privacy as you're working. This is very, very cute. And then if you come upstairs, the we have the bedroom. staircase. Ooh. Yep, we have the bedroom here, the Star <laughs> Wars posters, because we love Star Wars. Oh my goodness. This is like mine, like how small it is, but I love yep. it. It's so cute. And you can also turn the lights off. Or oh, on. wow. We fancy. Where is the light? Oh, this. Yeah. I did not know it did that. Yep, you can hook it up. And then if you go in here, it's the bathroom. Oh my gosh, I see what you mean now. You know what, though? It works. Yeah, you've got the toilet there, you walk down there, wash your hands, have a shower and all that. Yeah, shower, bathtub, you got everything you need. I know. So and cute. then, if we come back downstairs and go out the back door. Oh, we have your garden. Brings it into a little back garden, you've got a couple benches, a watering can, some bins, wind chimes. Oh my gosh, Scott, this is adorable, I love it. You just live your life out here in the garden. It's very cute. It is very cute. Even got the bird bath. You got the swinging chair. I love yep. this garden. It's so cute. Oh, can very... I see too? <gasps> you can. Look at us being cute. Oh my gosh, this is adorable. I love this. I love it. You can come and see my pig now. I mean, he looks a little bit squished, but I was I trying. Like him. I was trying not to give him too much of a big forehead because that's a worry. But yeah. I feel like he needed it. Like he needed one more block at the top. But you know, he's he's fine. He's fine. He just a oh, little I bit like squished. Little, I like a little tree swing. Yeah, we have a tree swing. Mm. You know, we don't have a fancy old swinging chair, so we just have oh, the tree. Yeah, <laughs> yep. Just use the tree. Use your resources that you've got. Yeah, and then we come across here because I didn't do a door at the front. I did my door round the side, and it's a secret hidden door. That's not so secret. You can totally tell it's there. there I was going to say, I was like, it was secret until the overhang, the awning gave it yeah. away. Yeah, and then you're straight <laughs> in here. We are. It's in actually the... bigger than I thought it was going to be when you come inside. Really? Yeah, like when you come in, I was like, oh, it's actually. I think because you've not done like a full second level, it makes it seem a lot bigger. Yeah, I was kind of going for the open feel, but mm -hmm. it was also just to help me save space really because I couldn't do a top floor. So this yeah. is our little living room area. We just have a oh, sofa, yeah. a table. We have a kitchen here with, of course, a money bank and he's so happy Aww. look at this guy he's so cute and then we have the bathroom in here again it's okay. very small yeah. it's kind of like yours with how small it is but it works I like it. you have yeah, everything definitely. you need super cute and then are you ready for the tiniest bedroom in the world of course i like your little under stairs desk as well that's very cute i just made use of the space you know there was nothing yep. else i could have done with it here so i was like i love the that. little hanging plant they're so cute that's aren't so they cute. Oh, and then this, this is, is the bedroom <laughs> yeah i mean it's honestly i think it's either the same size or bigger than mine so really we're the same yeah i think we are just a single person living inside of an animal i really like completely it. normal thank you i really liked your house too well if you had to say which build you liked the best what would you say i I enjoyed them both, but I'm going to be biased to my own build because, like, the cow looks really cute. Yeah, the cow is it adorable. It doesn't look squished. See, I love the outside of your building. It doesn't look squished. You have added extra horns. You know, you've got your ears. You've got this adorable snout. And you have a back mm. garden, whereas mine is kind of very long and squished. But from the front, yours looks fine. Yeah, it looks okay from the front. But the only thing is, I really like the interior of mine because it's yeah. pink. It's so pink. I just it's love that. It's very, very pink. <laughs> I just went yellow. I just wanted something to stand out against the brown. I liked it, though. But it's not up to us anyway who wins today's yep. build versus. It's up to you guys watching. So if you would let me know down in the comment section which build you thought was best. Is it the pig house or was it the cow house? And if you enjoyed this video and you would like to watch another one, click the end cards and let's go watch it together.